Holly, um, talk us through your emotions after that day before you in a Bradford City shirt. Yeah, I think it's a bit of a sweet moment for me. Um, it's a shame about the result, but I feel like we'll go again on Tuesday. Yeah, a lot of positives to take away from today's game, despite the result, despite the performance. Um, how was the mood? How was the feeling in, in the changing room uh, after the game? Everyone was disappointed, obviously, about uh, the result, but I feel like all, all the boys in the changing room said, come on, let's go again uh, on Tuesday and we'll get another run going. What's it like for you as a player arriving into a, a changing room that has been on this unbeaten run, that of course has tasted defeat for the first time in well over a month now? What's that like for you? Uh, I feel like all the lads have been class me from, from the first day I came in till now. Um, so I feel like I'm just going to help, help the team and they're going to help me and uh, we'll carry on uh, these performances and, and start another run going. Mm. Talk us through your goal then. Uh, you didn't stop running. Was it a case of just chancing your arm and, and sniffing the danger? Yeah, I feel like the gaffer told me to go and press high um, and I felt like I've just never given up and I've gone round the keeper, maybe took it a bit too wide, but luckily I've just uh, put the ball in the back of the net and really happy with it. It's one of those ones, isn't it, that sometimes when it goes that wide, you never know if you're going to be able to angle your body round enough to, to drag it in. Were, were you happy when you made the connection and you could see it was it was rolling into the empty goal? Yeah, it was a great feeling to score my uh, first goal for Bradford and hopefully there's many more to come. What does this move mean for you, um, Ollie? Because we've, we've heard from Ryan Sparks midweek who has said that you, if you could have done, you'd have done a backflip in his office when you signed for the football club. Um, it, it sounds as if you were really, really happy to arrive at, at Bradford City. Yeah, I'm really happy to be here. Uh, it's a proud achievement to play for Bradford City Club because it's such a massive club. Um, and hopefully over the next couple of years, I can develop as a footballer. Uh, and play as many games as possible uh, and just work hard under the managers. What does it signify in your career, this move, Oli? Uh, I think it's going to give me a good platform to go and play games uh, and just develop as a player uh, and work hard. That's the type of lad I am. just really want to work hard and knuckle down now. Mm. And, and are you more suited then to playing on this, on this left-hand side that we saw you playing in today? Can we expect to see that more from you or can you go out onto the right if needs be? Um, I, I do play both sides um, I have played right and left um, this season at the start of Wigan I was playing on the right but I can also play on the left um, I feel like on both sides I do mix my game up um, so hopefully I can just carry on carry on doing well and working hard